Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'll be doing a Beautylish 2023 Lucky Bag Unboxing. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get the extra large one, so I got the regular one in the fair to medium shade. So let's get started. The box is pretty big, so that's exciting. wrapping paper i love their wrapping paper it's so pretty so the text is lucky bag 2023 very cute now more than ever we want to celebrate community and connection this year's lucky bag design is dedicated to you our global community we hope the surprises inside serve as a reminder that we're all in this together Hashtag lucky bag 2023. Hashtag beautylish. Cute. Okay. First thing. Let's see. We will need some of this paper. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. It's really well wrapped. <laughs> More wrapping. <laughs> okay. First thing. Let's see. Oh, okay. I feel a bottle. I really, really hope it's not hair care products. <sighs> Fingers crossed. Oh, or, oh, it's a hair care product. <laughs> Every year, oh, this box is annoying. Every year they give us a hair care product and I never, ever use it. Never. I've never used them. Um, two years I got something for curly hair. I don't have curly hair. Uh, and then one year I got, um, was it a, what was it? It's like a dry shampoo, but it wasn't dry. <laughs> it was like a spray and it smelled really bad. So, or yeah, it made my hair smell really bad. Anyway, this is from Verb. Extra hydration, glossy shine, heat protect. I don't straighten my hair. I don't blow dry my hair. Just, okay. Glossy shine spray with heat protection. <sighs> Something else I'll never use. This is always very disappointing. This is like the main thing that I dislike about the Lucky Bags. The hair care products. I really wish they wouldn't do this. Just, I never use them. Never ever. Fold this back. Okay. <sighs> okay. Okay. I feel a box, and it's rectangular. And I'm thinking this is a got a good molecules thing, because it's kind of heavy. Let me see. Yep. Sure enough. <sighs> Exfoliating toner. Oh no! I got this last year, and I haven't used it, because I tried to. I got a. What was it? Was it a smaller bottle? I don't know. Or a... What did I get? Anyway, I tried a toner and toners don't work on me. I've tested a few now and yeah, they actually uh, dry uh, my make my face very dry and flaky and awful and toners don't work for me. I don't know what it is, but yeah. And it's exactly the same one as last year. That's disappointing. Oh gosh, this is not looking good. I'm really disappointed I didn't get the extra large one because last year I got the extra large bag and that was really, really good. Oh, yay! At least I got Wayne Goss. I can always count on Wayne Goss. The essential lip pencil in the shade Mauve. Let's see what shade that is. Yep. Something I can use. Oh. nice color perfect love it and is this a brush yes 
this is a brush by Yano Series. Yano Series by Beautylish. This is the second. I think yeah, I believe this is the second Yano Series brush I've gotten. I don't. I don't know what Yano is or who Yano is. But I think I like, and even though I never used it, every time I touch it, <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, that's nice. <laughs> oh god, I can't open it. I'm assuming it's real hair, because it's very, very soft. Yeah. I don't know what this type of brush is used for. Contour, maybe? I'm guessing that's what it's for. It's very, very soft. But yeah. That's cool, I guess. I'm not sure if I have any use for it, but that's nice. I think a second to let No, there's a couple more products in here. Ooh! The Luxury, Luxury Cream Lipstick by Wayne Goss. Nutmeg. I already have this shade, so I'm not gonna open it. But I already have it and I do like it, so that's pretty cool. I have a backpack now. Now next is Mob Repurpose Compact. I don't know what this is. Is this like an eyebrow thing? Oh, I don't know what this is for. It's just it's just an empty compact, I guess. And you put your eyeshadow or whatever fits in here, I suppose. I guess that's what it is. It says repurpose compact. I did feel something in here, so maybe you, it's like a, an insert. Okay, insert. Ah, yes. It's a blush, mob blush in the shade. What is it? M15? Yeah, blush refill. That's cool. I don't really want to open it. it. It's quite cute like this. I do like it. That's nice that you that you can just use a refill for this, and this is reusable. I do like that. It's pretty cool. And the, if it's if the shade is anything like what's out here, it's a pretty good shade too. Oh, look at the. Wrapping, how pretty. That's cool. Next, oh, I think, yeah, this is our last product. Feels like a palette, but what kind of palette? Let me just remove it. Oh, wow, it's the Natasha Denona Glam Palette. That's pretty cool i was not expecting this that's pretty nice i don't have it so that's quite exciting glam palette i think do i have anything i don't think i have any of the large natasha denona palettes actually i just have the minis and then like the five pan ones yeah i think that's all i have so this is pretty cool actually Wow. Very pretty. I'll definitely use it. So this is pretty exciting. This is very nice. Okay. Not bad. Not my favorite box, I must say. But, let me put the carton back. Not my favorite box, but, I don't know. I think, um, realistically, the only, the yeah, actually, it wasn't a very good box. I mean, this is very exciting, of course, and I'm glad I got this. I'm very happy with this, and I'm very happy with this. But these are the only two items that I'm actually going to use or get a lot of use out of. So, and I think combined, this might be a little over the 75 that I made. So I got my money's worth with a little bit of a discount. But it's not really great value if I think about how I'm not going to use these other items. Like the hairspray, the brush. One day maybe I'll use it. I do like the lip liner, but I don't often use lip liners. That's once in a while. 
this i won't use unfortunately toners don't work for me they make my my face very dry and flaky and it's quite awful <laughs> and then actually this is pretty cool okay so three items that i will use and then four items that i mm, well actually two items that i'll never use and two items that i might use once in a while it's okay it's not a terrible bag but yeah and i don't know what it is with the beautylish uh, lucky bags i usually I'm a bit disappointed at first and then throughout the year I find use for the products that I think I'm gonna hate except for the hair care products and at the end of the year I'm pretty happy I bought the box but it takes a whole year but this time for sure these two I won't be able to use which is a bit sad but yeah not bad well no not good I don't know it's okay. It's an okay box. I'm disappointed, but not that disappointed. Not as disappointed as I have been in past years, because I know that eventually I'll come around and really love all my products, or at least the ones that I can use. But yeah, this is cool. These two are very good. So the, these two make me happy. All right. Did you get a, a lucky bag this year? What did you get in yours? Did you get the same things that I did? I don't know. Do you think I'll ever find a use for this? I mean, my, oh, I am letting my hair grow. I have really short hair, but I am trying to let it grow. And sometimes I do need to straighten it a little bit. So maybe I'll try this. So maybe see already, maybe I'll find a use for something. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much for watching. Have a good rest of your day. Bye.